Check, 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 check. You know, if, I, if we're not disturbing somebody's reading, then it's okay. <laughs> I'll, I'll get right back to the reading as soon as uh, we're done rocking, I, I hope. Our uh, young adult services person had heard about them through uh, the King County Library System, and it looked like a fun program. Mm -hmm. Tim, let me stamp your hand. Both my parents are library directors. I can make my parents proud and play death metal at the same time. Hi, this is another boys and girls children of all ages. The King County Library System is proud to present its Edu Cult Kings of Seattle! Play a video of really short heavy metal songs about science fiction authors. Try to scratch your eyes up real tight and pay attention. Yeah, actually, everybody should stick something in their ears. Because it's going to get plenty loud. So I hope we didn't lose you on that one. The basic idea is show music fans the literary inspirations for their favorite songs by their favorite heavy metal musicians. And it kind of mutated into the, uh, the general uh, idea that rock fans need to get smarter. <laughs> and we, we're here to, to teach them. Uh, these are all people we're playing tonight. Gibson, McGuinn, Marion Zimmer Bradley, Robert Heinlein, and then we're also playing Arthur C. Clarke. The most famous book begins with a two and ends with a one. <laughs> wow. 21? Two and one. <laughs> There's definitely authors that we don't deal in, like uh, Stephen King or Dean Arcoons. No Dragonlance or Forgotten Realms books. Nothing that's like Timescape 4, The Lost. Escape. Nothing set in the Star Trek or Star Wars universe. Oh yeah, and nothing by this Joker. Done literacy faith healings on a couple times. The last guy I did in Portland claimed he couldn't read, so I brought him up on stage. I uh, took out a, a Frank Herbert book, I grabbed him by the back of the head, and I opened the book and stuck it on his face, and lowered him back onto the ground, brought him up, smacked him in the head with the book, I picked it back up, and handed him the book. He read, and all and behold, the power of the word filled him. Praise the word. Real name was Alex Schroeder. Lead free or die. We've got these five, five commemorative. Uh, read for your yeah. dollar I'm Sure, it's there. Are they free? No. No, they're not. No, free. no. But free, we do have a personalized reading list. Yes, those are for free. <laughs> Which got a lot of good books. A lot of, of kids who are into heavy metal, especially classic metalheads, read a lot. You know, fantasy and sci-fi. I mean, I know I did. So, hey, see you later, man. Thanks a lot. You know, I really am doing this for the kids. This is great. This is one of his best ones. Uh, it's cool. I mean, these kids seem to genuinely like it. Uh, so that makes me happy. Oh, like, you know, they still didn't clap. Yeah. I think that would appeal to everyone. All I heard was the, the one, uh, the guy 
try to sing. Ugh. Does it like hurt your throat? It's cool sounding. It's loud. It's yes, it's loud. Like I think I'm in deaf in this ear. Blood Hague is cool. This is pretty good music, I think. Yeah, but you guys have cool uniforms. You guys have those weird glasses on and stuff. Do you guys like science fiction authors and yeah. stuff? We like, we like Harry, Harry Potter. Potter. Harry Potter. Harry Potter. I know that's okay, too. You know, that's okay. I like science fiction just a little. Reading and music, best yeah. things in the world combined. What? Okay. It does feel like coming home. I spent a lot of good times and equal amount of bad parts of my life where I was at a library. So this is like, it's, it's a microcosm to me. Are you going to come back? Yeah. When? When? I don't know. Are you going to perform again? Why don't you guys write us, okay? Okay. See you guys later. Bye! Blood Hag kicks ass! <laughs> <laughs> if this is as far as it went, if we all of a sudden switched to only play in the libraries, or if we just stop right now, this would be enough for me. Because it's cool, it's like full circle. <laughs> Is everybody still paying attention? Yeah. Okay. It's okay if you're reading, but if you don't have anything to do and you're not paying attention, what happens is you put your heads down on your test. I see this one all the time, but I'm way afraid to uh, pick it up just because of that teddy bear looking thing with the handcuffs on. I got more. It looks cool because you can almost see the boobies. Oh, you gotta love that. To that, right like that. And, and, and if there's a fight.